Let me just Let me zona jamu fura kama mandazi eh. Erika Erika mfuranga. Erika mfuranga sasa ni moja hivi. Alama najipaka anga salad. Kuja msa. Bien. Kali grojo. Amefura combo first of all. Then he's short. No offense to short people. Nowadays you know you have to be like politically correct in everything. Erika ananifikia mali hapa. So mimi namuona kama mtoi wangu. So ni mse mkubwa in denial. He's a big guy. He's a big guy in a short package. You see. <laughs> so even if he's supposed to atani kimshika tu bikichwa. Jabe yake hazi fika because I'm a bit longer. I'm, I'm lengthier. So let's let's see maybe it might Hey beautiful people so welcome to our YouTube channel. Tuko wengi sana hapa na tuko na mzito obize mwenyewe. Amepigwa lakini sahi yako sa. No 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 no. no. Don't call me obize because if you call me obize mm-hmm. that name of mine was taken with it someone else. Who took it? Sio Tile Brown. Ah. Si anajitaka pia obize. You know he calls himself obize which is okay. So mine is obize. So I should call you so obize. Mine is obize. Uh-huh. His is obize. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, so different. How are you? Beautiful. You beautiful. Successful. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Leo tuko kwa show ya. Muna believe kwa hiyo kitu. Okay, happy Valentine's to everybody. Thank you so much. Because pale ilikuwa kwa Instagram uli wish men peke yake. Yes, I was wishing men because nobody really care about. You know Valentine is supposed to be a celebration of love. Mm-hmm. Love goes both ways. Mm-hmm. It's to the woman, to the man, the man to the woman. Mm-hmm. But now today it was just about the woman. Mm-hmm. So I was like all the all the men happy Valentine's. I can't buy all of you flowers but Happy Valentine's. Uh-huh. Okay, Obina kabla tuingie kwa stories zingine we here because of uh, this show. Yes. Of course CMG Records na Captain Otoyo. Yes. Yes. What can you say about the show? Will you still love me in the morning? Yes. <laughs> Will you still? Sasa una pendanga mtu kwa giza. Unajua? <laughs> Malight the kifanyanga fanyanga hivi anainuka anainama anainuka kwa club unamwona na umuoni and then you like oh god damn. Mm-hmm. And then munamuka Roy Sambu. Hana muka sibu na pata na pika chai na mwangalo na mwambia wewe ni nani? <laughs> no wewe ni nani? Hata si wewe ni leta jana. What? So that's why the question is will you still love me in the morning? Yeah. Basically when you're sober, when you are you know the morning is when all the thoughts are aligned. Mm-hmm. So Toy is doing the third show. So we're here to support him. We have to have a good time also I'm here with CMG Records, yeah. a couple of artists that have been signed. They'll also be showcasing their talent. Mm-hmm. So that's why we're here today. Mm-hmm. And yes. It's like you are familiar with the story will you love me in the morning? Has it yeah. ever happened to you before? Uh, a friend of mine. <laughs> <laughs> is that a, somebody I know. Come on guys. What do you I think? Of? No, 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 no. This is just somebody I know. We won't judge you. Uh-uh. See your Mimi. Ni rafiki yangu ni. Okay, na kuna mtu amekuwish happy Valentine's kweli? Eh, my mom did in the morning. My mom was the first person to do it. Uh-huh. And then a couple of other people. I have some crazy fans. Mm-hmm. So kuna wale amenishia Valentine kula ndako nipeleka lunch. Kuna wale ndako nipeleka supper. I'm like, oh, this is a setup. Tutaenda tukule alafu niambie lipa bill. Na mwezi fenye mbeka kwa kona. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Obize. Uh, Ob- <laughs> Obina, after yeah. the your scandal with Erko Moyo ah, vale kiss. Scandal. It was, sc- not, it was a scuffle. A scuffle. Those are two Kuliona, you are daughter. You are Dora. She was asking you a lot of questions. Oh yes, yes, yes. Yes, that was it true. Erko Moyo alikuchapa. Yeah. I don't know how uh-huh. you took it. Si Erko Moyo alikuchapa. Stop uli, rephrasing the uh-huh. thing. Uh-huh. Is it true ulichapa Erko Moyo? Ama ulitaka kuchapa Erko Moyo? So the intention was clear but it didn't happen. Hakuna mm-hmm. blow ilifikia mtu because we had a couple of people who wali blockish everything. Yeah. But the purpose was something was supposed to land. Mm-hmm. But now it did not land. So the issue see ulichapwa nini? No no no. Mulitaka mm-hmm. ku but we didn't. Mm-hmm. Yes. Did it affect your daughter? Maybe. Yes. Because, so first of all, mm-hmm. they got home so they come on Friday. Mm-hmm. So they got home then the first thing they saw it and then she called me. Mm-hmm. She video called me. I think I was I was somewhere. She like dad, ni mbona nani anakuchokoza? She's five. Nani anakuchokoza? Hebu mlete hapa anakuchokoza. I'm like mom, relax. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. So that's the way Lola normally is. I don't think it really affected them because they know their dad, show business, entertainment. And I always tell them that the things you see on social media don't take them to heart because nowadays kids get a lot of content online. They ask me a lot of things like my second last born daughter is now into Ronaldo. She loves Ronaldo because the brother 
swayed her into it. So them dad, umuna Ronaldo ameenda huku. Dad, ati Ronaldo ameshinda kufunga. Dad, ati wanasema Ronaldo afukuze. Dad, they are so much into the things they see on the social spaces. So you have to tell them some things are meant to be like that so you can think a certain way. So when you start telling them in a, in a nini age, all the time, they only see even sometimes you look at a movie, they're like, ah, ni movie. Mm. Oh, da, 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 da. So they know because that is where they And also they, they have quite a serious following. Nowadays I walk with them in a mall. Mm. Guys, ah, Lola, Liron, nini, nini. So guys are calling them. So I've also tried to teach them how to adapt and how to know that showbiz is make-believe. The only difference is their, their channel is real. Their channel is 100% non-scripted, like we always just go and me, I just take the phone and record, or my cousin, or my son, and they just say these things and it just happens. Their channel is not scripted, but I always tell them every other thing, Kula Kula Show, da 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 da, apart from the guests, you can't script the guests, so they know. And of course, uh, speaking of Eric Omondi, yes. like somebody posted Leo about you. Okay. And uh, of course, someone said that he, it was bad for him to lay a hand on a woman. Okay. <laughs> now, that is the mentality that I'm trying to fight, mm -hmm. uh, talking about uh, to stop gender-based violence against men. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, someone who posts that means mm -hmm. it is right to lay a hand on a man. You get? Mm -hmm. You guys get the drift. Mm -hmm. If you say, you didn't get the memo, it's bad to lay a hand on a woman. Mm -hmm. So, what are you saying? So if he was a man, you have a right to lay a hand on him. You see, so violence basically is just not, it's just not right in all aspects. Mm -hmm. You see, like even I saw other people talking about the video, they're like, mm -hmm. really? Do I look that stupid? No. Do, do I? <laughs> no, really? Like, so that, ay, 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 ay. Do you know how much money you will be sued for? You can go to prison. That's assault, mm -hmm. you know, and it's uh, punishable in the court of law. Mm -hmm. So, what to see Wajinga, one, <laughs> then let's stop insinuating that it is right to do something to men and it's not right to do it to women. Mm -hmm. We're all human beings. Mm -hmm. Let's just try and uh, be very open-minded about things. Let's be level-headed and let's be kind. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Your fans so, are please, just to clear the air, babu. Still could not want to contemplate whether that thing was real, or it was scripted, or you guys were just having fun. So that thing I hike was like nifek to you guys were No no no, I'll not say that because this is what I would say. When you're in the matrix, it depends on how you consume. Trust me, right now the people who came to my inbox are like, how how dare you do such a thing to the commodity? Mm -hmm. And there are people that I meet them like, I'm gonna finish your kijana, me too so yes. Mm -hmm. We have different people, different sides, kuna watu mani, kuna watu So I'll not come out and tell you it was scripted. You watch the video, however you decide to consume it. Trust me, the minute you see something on social media. There are normally two sides. Even if today I come and say, you know, I hate Eric Omondi, mm. people just come and say, ah, Wongo. Mm. And if I come and say, no, it was scripted, ah, Wongo. Mm. It's always the same thing. Me, I meet people telling me, Obina. Nambi, I miss you, Obina. When you Obina. <laughs> I'm like, eh, Mazen, I see where, where, see where, I see. Yeah, so it's like that. So that's for me to know and for you to find out. And uh, let's give it time. Yes, but uh, sometimes, enjoy showbiz. It's show. Showbiz. Enjoy the show. And uh, don't put it too hard. Nikama politics. Wake up lungs. Breathe in, <laughs> breathe out. Yeah, yeah. If you put it to the lungs sometimes, because now most of, most of the people that I talk to, they want the industry to be boring. Mm. The industry was very flat. Most millennials know. Do you remember when kleptomaniacs and bamboo had beef? It was clipped. Bambu, I'm a nini. Prezo is coming through. Sijui nani nani, I'm a fanya nini. Sijui yogopa DJs, I have beef in Calif Records. Da, 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 da. Sijui Juakali is not talking to nonini. Like, it's always been there. So a lot of people now just want people to be working like this. Oh, I'm at peace with everybody. I'm, I, when I'm a stone. The only way you can be at peace with everybody is if you don't talk, you don't do anything. That's not me. I talk too much. And maybe for our true fans who have been asking if you guys solve your issues, maybe off camera, and because to solve, to solve issues off camera yeah. with who? With the tongue guy. <laughs> Checking out busy no. on a serious note. No, I've said no. <laughs> no, I don't want to talk to that tongue guy. No, no. On a, on a serious note. No, my issue with Eric actually, if you see. It's about Eric always bashing people. Mm -hmm. That was my issue. I'm like, stop bashing people all the time. Just talk to people. Mm -hmm. Don't go on social media and then just talk. Hey, no, 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 you're so stupid. People, wake up. You guys are going through a lot of shit. Just talk to people. That was the only issue, actually. That is the only thing that, and when I ask him, are you fluid? 
and then you took offense to it. That was the only issue. I'm like, just come out. It's a safe space. Yeah. You see, that was the like we don't have any other issue. Even with the Rikomondi initially, when he had when the beef started, he spoke. Then I said, no, don't do this. You, I know you. You do A, B, C, D. So that has always been the issue. There's nothing major that we sat down. I'm like, you know, I hate. I like his content. I like what he does. I comment sometimes. He comments on my own. Sometimes I tag him. But when you do something wrong, I call you out. So on a serious note, we're busy. Muki pick a fight with the thong guy, blow on a sema. Because we're going to go on a way of it. Yeah, I'm going to bounce out. I'm going to chill here. I'm going to play on a way of it. I'm going to chill here. Okay, you what do you think? <laughs> let, let me just say, what do you think? 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 No offense to short people. Nowadays, you know, you have to be like politically correct in everything. Eriko na nifikia mali hapa. So mina mwana kama mto yuangu, so ni mse mkubwa in denial. It's a big guy, it's a big guy in a short package. You see? <laughs> so even if it's supposed to, ata ni kimishika tui bikichua, jabe yake hezi fika because I'm a bit longer. I'm, I'm lengthier. So, Let's, let's see, maybe it might happen, we don't know. It might happen sooner or later, we might meet one on one, you who you mean me, alafu bila mabounsa, alafu tuone kita enda aje. But before that, also you know, so people need to be provoked. Like right now, I can't meet Eric and we start fighting. Kwa nisi ni watoto, unless he comes, I'll defend myself. Lakini mini toke nenda kupigia na Eric. Hey, haki nijikute. I have better things to do. And Obina, uli compare apa na ito Priscilla Waimani, the lady who mwenye likuwa kiwiso. Uli compare na Duruman mwenye likuwa kifanya the same, but here japata any achievement. The same thing na this guy mwenye likuwa nafanya... Rigiji. Yeah, Rigiji. And this other lady that nicknamed Rigadi Gashagu. So maybe what made you think of this and unonaje like the boy child anafanyua aje in this Kenya? So I've been through a lot of situations myself. And I started talking about this even before Rigiji came, the, before they got power. And uh, I was in my own situations. And I've realized through life that we empower girl child so much we forget boy child. So I'm always telling people, empower girl child, yes, but also empower boy child. You see, uh, protect girl child, yes, but also protect boy child. That has always been my message, always, because I also have a son. I have a couple of God sons that I'm trying to protect and groom and I'm like no man should be left behind mm -hmm. and a lot of men come talking to me oh, being I'm going through this or oh, being I'm going through that and I'm like the only way mm -hmm. that this can stop is if we start talking about it mm -hmm. so when Rigi G happened I saw it I think I spoke about it somewhere maybe on radio or somewhere and then also the Priscilla Imani happened story then I also spoke about it again on radio and then now people started talking about it online. Then I'm like, I already spoke about this. I already saw this. And I'm like, listen, Nduruman was doing the same thing that Priscilla is doing. Nobody was noticing. He had to start going to extreme lengths. That's why he went to State House. He went to Chokosa and Police, guys. Because he's really struggling. Guys, I'm trying. You see, nobody cared. Priscilla whistled three, four times, and she's got an ambassadorial job. She's got an everything. I don't blame her. She's good. She's doing whatever. She's having fun. And the person that I saw in the picture signing the contract with her was a woman. So you see, women are looking out for women. But men, when you see another man doing something, they're like, eh. KK came out, was imitating Rigiji 150%. Guys were having a ball. Guys are just like, oh, you're so funny. Huh? People keep quiet. Oh, you're so funny. Huh? Keep quiet. Rigiji comes, learns about the name, takes the, 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 the chick gives her a jobo, she now works with him in his office, I don't know what she does, but she's doing something good for her, I'm happy for her. KK comes and says, guys, help me raise school fees, man, I'm, I'm struggling. He came out and he was going through school fees, guys sent some money, he's my boy, I sent something small, incognito mode, dini nini, guys are like, okay. Even when KK came to my show, Kula Kula show, I gave her, I gave him sneakers. Because he came, then I looked at his sneakers, and I was like, this guy probably walks a lot. And then for guys, when you give them sneakers, is have you seen my sneaker game? Yeah, I was Fire. almost getting there. Good. So, I gave him sneakers as a gift, man to man. I'm like, bro, man, this is, you know, something for you. But now when he was crying for help, for school fees, nobody did anything. Not even Rigiji, who he was like imitating, and guys, guys were just like, mm. So, most of us jammers were like, ah, you see? So that is what happens all the time. 
and even we've seen some remarks that have been made on digital spaces with ladies mm -hmm. and guys you look the other way they're like mm. and then when it's a man oh cancel how could you fire them da, 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 da. same thing happened to my friend Tumbili gender-based violence he had evidence blood everything mm -hmm. went to the police station guys just like ah uh, clout, clout chasing, or you know, ni mwanaume, ah. If it was Tumbili who laid a hand on that woman, leave even blood, one black eye, Tumbili now would be in jail. Nobody would want to hire Tumbili. And all these men were here would go like, hey, we umezika Tumbili ameshikwa, hey, ni kunoma, ni kumoto manze. That's what would happen. But because he's a woman, nobody gives a shit. The woman is still running around, still sending insults and everything. She went and created some fake video and said, oh, no, 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 whatever, whatever, whatever. And life goes on because boy child is on his own. But who is there to support boy child? Other boy children. So what do we do? We embrace each other. We start listening to each other. We stop mocking each other. We start supporting each other. Someone comes, someone is like the story for Tumila. Always get someone, someone starts joking. Who knows Tumila? My friend. It's not funny. But if you say it and I laugh about it, they say it and they laugh about it, everybody says it and they laugh about it, it becomes a laughing matter and nobody's serious about it. So we are the ones to start doing that. That is why I brought the story for Priscilla Imani and I brought the story for the chick who named Ricky G. And I'm not feeling bad for them. I'm actually very happy for them. I'm just saying, there's also a guy who does this. Can we give him something? Okay, let's pay school fees for him. Let's, okay, let's buy him a camera. There's Nduruman. I'm like, there's also a guy Let's look for him. Where's Duruman? We don't know. Now in town, there's another guy who just walks around and just hugs people, just doing a video. Guys see the video and just, guys, wait until a woman does the same thing. You will see. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. But does this mean uh, women are more supportive compared to men? Yes. Why the don't reason, you be like men now? The reason is women have more emotions vested. Mm -hmm. Women are emotional beings. Wanaume sa ingine, akili mtu wangu maze, usiweke roho maze. Dema naona kola, aki, oh my god, aki the way she's whistly, aki woye, aki let's take her to Mombasa, aki she needs to cool down, aki enda piki binja kwa Indian Ocean. Exactly. Aki tuende tu, aki enda yuvu unajua, aki woye, let's, let's empower our own, let's talk about our own, you see. Women are more emotional and they are attached to whatever touches their emotions from relationships to parenting to everything. And then especially if it touches another woman, they're like, Aki woye, do you know that could be your mother? That could be your sister? Aki, if it's your daughter? And then they're on that space. But for men, I wanna ask if that could be your mother or your brother or your nini. Ah, we omori wacha ngangane ba. We omori pia mina jituma maze. Men, I wanna hide your emotions, put a face in front of you that is very, you know, hard, don't think about nothing. Don't think of nobody. It's me or me. That's the difference. That's why I'm trying to urge men, come out, talk to each other. Allow your emotions to take over sometimes because men are imploding. That's what I always say. That's the only reason. It's not a bad thing. It's a good thing that women are doing. I'm just trying to tell men, atuko mau mau. You know mamu iluko mwana umu wana jivita kwa mstuni. Tuntafuta mzungu, tunamufinya. Tunarudi yapa na marasta, tunakula, tuchiki na wademu. Mademu kai kando. But women were sitting together, working after firewood, working pika, working chota magi, one on Galeshana. One almost go to orders to look like Finarani, twenty, could all of Zunga Bajanguka Badeas. So men were conditioned like that, even as the millennials. Maybe the Gen Z is different, but millennials were told, Manomeni Kujikaza, Kangumu. Now I'm trying to tell men it's okay to cry, it's okay to talk, it's okay to complain. It's okay to say if something is hurting, you say, bro, nani umiza maze, si, buda, muli kanyaga jola kini, sawa maze, unacheki. Mile, eh, buda, unani kanyaga, oh, sorry, sorry. Most men don't say sorry. Why? Eh, buda, mimi, ni apologize maze, ni apologize aje maze. Gangsta points. Eh, gangsta points maze, unajua mama me nishika jola kini, ni me kanyagia maze, ni me kuwaria maze, kiumane maze, misi zi sema. Just go say sorry. Sorry, I fucked up, it'll never happen again. This is not my strength, this is my weakness. Ni, 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 ni. Something like that. Yeah. Women total. Women total, yeah. Like she talked, okay, she was. I she talked about she was Baba. Mocking Baba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you talked about this MCA man yeah. who also talked about Toto. But now this is. not MCA, he's MP for Mumias East, yeah. Salasia. Yo, Salasia. Yeah. He first, did he first the law or 
who? It was Kwambox who was saying that one is more worse than. Yeah, so the situation is this. Toto was mocking Baba that Baba has been defeated a couple of times. Then Salasia said, Wacha kuongeja wa Baba na kupiga mimba. And a lot of people understood it differently. I'm a comedian, I looked at it from the funny angle. I'm like, yo, don't talk about Baba, unezapata mimba ujupe nyi metokea. So that was in my head. But kusema unezapata mimba ujupe nyi metokea, it doesn't mean someone is going to sexually assault you. They're grown-ups, they've been elected, they're leaders. It means for you to be a leader, you have some balls for you to get. So that was the angle I saw it from. But other people saw it from the point of, how can you say such a thing about, you want to impregnate someone? You need to apologize. And a lot of people took it on that other side. So it is a debate that different people are debating differently. And two things can happen. One, people can decide and ignore and say, ah, it's just a funny comment and everything. Or other people can go and say, no, 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 no. How can you say, how can you say something like that? That thing that I told you again, and I've said it all the time, most of the time, most women look at it that men are fighting them. And all the time their defenses are up. Ukisema tu kitu, unaniambia aje? Umenameni pike kwa sababu I'm a lesser of a human being. Umenameni nini? And then some men also have the madharau, the one for, uni wanamuke. Wanamuke ananambia nini? Wee na kupika kamimba na usonge uko gano. Wee utulie, pika u mimba tulie. Mvunje mugu. Wee don't kufunja mugu. Mvunje mugu. So different people have those ones because they were raised differently. Different parenting, exposure, information and knowledge and intelligence. They are different for different people. So the way people relate to different things. So that's why you spoke about the story. I didn't get to say my side because when Kwambok said he should apologize and everything, I was like, okay. But Salastia was obviously joking. Yeah, of course. He, he was did. joking. But and now, then even the way he said it there. Blah, 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 blah. I, then Salastia in a cartoon. Alafu in the case of Toto, like he was not joking. No, Toto was saying, Baba, I'm a complainer, I'm mingi sana, is whatever. I don't know if she needs to apologize. Mine was coming from the comedy pers uh, perspective. Even if I said Toto needs to apologize, it's from comedy perspective. Like, Unambia je baba buwana? Baba is a nigma buwana. Unambia baba me, wana say nwa buwana. Baba jayu say nwa. Baba wana praya mo bozizo. Okay, baba the seventh. Okay, okay, hey, baba wana okay, jana. Okay, baba 2032. Baba na rigiji. Head to head. So, <laughs> that's the comedy side. But other people, even you see this comment I made now, other people are still gonna find offense with it, like yeah, true. Yeah. And of uh -huh. course, uh, he believed only the total was engaged. I don't know whether you are real. Yes, or yes, I've seen it. <laughs> but I'm a mama too. Apo simuto analia. Toto, tembe na mimi ni kufundishe. Apo na. Tembe na mimi ni kufundishe my emotion re. Oh my God. Mo mo awiv tu pa uko. You know. Yeah. Sasa toto ame simuto apo. Jamaa me ina mabela toto ame magale kama taku mapisha. Kwa kama Diana B. Diana B. Diana B. Diana B. Aya babe, she got no because. Weka machozi hapa toto. Machozi ni hapa. Unaona? Kama Karen nyamu anambiwa. Usikuje kwa pale ya menda vest. Kwa hapo. Basuza ubaya toto na Karen nyamu anakuanga. Machongumu. Awali. I'm like, ah. So, Bina, I said to Malaysia, po inge kwenye shoot. No, na tu kuna chumuli wasana na otoyo. It's like kwa rafu kwa jasana. Like, kama wajatu kabla wajatu kwa mwenye ungelelea smikas. Yes. Na hii ekonomi hii ni angapi? Sasa hizi, hii ni mepeo. Valentine's Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. So, I influence for Style Hub. And they normally dress me. This is their shirt. This is their jeans. These are their sneakers. They're called Style Hub. Other today they are giving away a couple of sneakers. Mm. So most of the time, most of the things I have new are patiwa. But still in patiwa for free, I work for it because I influence for it. So you know, kazi so na lipo na viatu. Very bad job. Unenda kuli parent na ukona viatu. The landlord unavasais. Landlord the middle one is thirty two. Today is the thirty three. But viatu le sema. Don't let it viatu for rent. Sinon, okay. I'm a miss, I'm but miss sour. I'm a miss. Miss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a miss. <laughs> two per side, two per side. Give Fikiria na mimi, Fikiria na mimi. <laughs> All right. Sour, sour. That's Thank okay. you. Yeah, Thank you so okay. much for hosting me, guys. Good job you're doing. Thank and like you. I always tell you guys, Thank you. try and post more positive information out there mm. so that we can encourage each other. Yeah. The nation is hurting. Mm. People are broke. People are in pain. People are confused. People are misinformed. Yeah. Okay, because like I always say, if you watch the news and read the news, you are misinformed. If you don't read and watch them, you are uninformed. So a lot of people are somewhere there. They're misinformed, are informed. People are in the middle there, but it all depends on you guys what you're putting out there. 
So let's try and put more positive content. And we never know. Majenzi kido wata chatu. So you know, just just now, I'm going to be too. Life is evil. Kuna time una liya, kuna time una checka. Yes, yes. Siko sawa. Sawa, Bina. Thank you. Gracias. Grazie.